all right what's going on youtube so in today's video we're going to keep it as short as possible we will be showing you guys exactly how you are going to be able to hide the scam nfts you're receiving in your OpenSea um, wallets and accounts and we're going to show you guys how to just hide maybe mints that you know you minted a long time ago and you just don't want them on your home page for people to see also like the title says of this video, we will also be showing you the new feature in OpenSea, which is called Featured Items, right? So just to show you guys what these featured items look like, we're gonna go to one of my favorite OpenSea accounts to watch and look at, Shamdu, and he has featured items. As you see, he has a title. This one, he says, who am I? He has a pudgy penguin and a winter bear. Um, these are his two pfps he switches back and forth between on twitter he also has an art section colors um you know photography toys other things like that so you can get real 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 creative with this new feature on OpenSea. but let's go ahead and start off with the first item so the first way how you can hide um your items on OpenSea is you want to just go ahead and click more options on the three dot button right it's going to bring up a lot of list of different options this one that we want to use is the hide feature so when you click hide you can now click the small plus button that's in the top right hand corner of each nft picture from each collection and you can add as many as you want so for me i'm going to be adding everything that's not currently from uh this year are that i don't really want to pay attention to when i go to my open c so i'm hiding a lot of stuff that are degen mints right here live with you guys and um you know just some stuff that uh was probably bought for me a while ago and didn't flip or bought for me a while ago and went to zero so we're gonna we got 22 items here i'm not sure how many items you can do in total but let's go ahead and hit the continue button as you see, all of those have vanished, and in the top bottom right hand corner of my screen, it showed that they have been moved to my hidden folder, right? So a lot of you guys might be wondering, wow, okay, so now I hid these NFTs, right? Where are these NFTs, right? Where are my NFTs at? So your NFTs are now in your hidden folder, right? To see your hidden folder, you have to scroll from the tabs in your homepage where it says collect it create it favorite activity and more click more and then you're going to click the hidden button and you can now see all of your hidden nfts now guys be very very mindful that your hidden nfts can be scam nfts right they can be scam nfts so you do not want to interact with other than hiding on OpenSea, um, as far as trying to sell these scam NFTs, if you get an NFT that you did not buy or you did not purchase um, that's high in value, like 0 0.1, 0 0.4, 100, $200, right? Whatever it be, um, just be very cautious how you interact with that NFT um, so you guys won't get scammed or you guys won't get P fished from uh, sending or using that NFT. But that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed that, right? <clears throat> um, we also forgot to show you guys one more step. I almost ended the video. I'm sorry. No cuts, no cuts, right? The hidden feature, the new feature of OpenSea that I just showed you guys was the featured items. You can click that by clicking the top three dots under your cart icon in OpenSea. You can create a section. Um, so I'm going to create a section. I'm just going to call it ENS names. And I'm just going to go ahead and choose the ENS names. It actually showed that collection that I typed in. So that was pretty helpful. And boom, we hit next. Oh, and this is where we actually add the title. So the actual title is going to be ENS names. to go ahead and add a description and title boom we hit done we can view it on our profile so now when we go to our profile under featured it shows um, ENS names 
um, this is probably what people are going to see when they click on your profile first um, and then your collections collected you know is what you can see or what other people can see but from now on for OpenSea is uh, showing your featured tab first so let's go back and to Shamdu for our example as you can see and when we type in his name it takes us to his featured page not his collected right so he has over 2,000 NFTs that he's collected um, he's recently bought a lot of ca uh, captains a lot of pudgies he also has the underground season one access pass right um, so you can't really see exactly his activity as far as their most recent NFTs he's bought from the feature tab um, that might be good or bad depending on what you want people to see or who's following you um, but it kind of gives you a little bit more privacy and also kind of you know uh, helps you curate your open profile to look cooler than before if you guys enjoyed this video and you guys want to see more videos on not only how to do stuff on open but how to keep yourself intact um, and safe in web3 make sure you like subscribe and comment so we can drop more videos just like this one peace